right behind me is a $3,000 per night hotel room with a bunch of security at the front entrance. And we're about to see if we can get through because it's definitely not for broke people like me. <laughs> I'm gonna try a brand new sneak in method for this one, which means I'm changing into a business suit disguise. Now we're looking fresh. Now we're looking like a billionaire. And we're about to make our way in. Let's go. Thank you. The suit worked. They said, I'll get back so acting like I belonged in here. Now, the two main things I desperately need to find to survive is any kind of food or a drink and a place to sleep where a security guard won't see me. Now, I've got to try and survive in here for 12 hours without being suspected or caught. And that's the only way I succeed this challenge. We just need to keep on moving. $100 million penthouse? What even is this? We're gonna go to level one. Back to this level. This is not good. These cameras. Do these even work? <laughs> Let's get away from that. Okay, I promise. I'm not going back to the restroom. That's not happening. <laughs> You've also probably noticed nobody is around because only the richest of rich can be here. This whole area is like golden. It's like Charlie and the Chopper Factory. <laughs> if needed, we could potentially sleep right here. This is luxury. But I could also hide underneath this couch right here, which could be a, an OP play. We might do that. <laughs> I told you dinguses, this place is exclusive and this is only level one. There's going to be three levels in this challenge and each one is going to get exponentially more harder and luxurious. You guys know how I how to get to the hotel rooms? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's this way? So I can all the way down to the there should be a reception there to help you. Thank you. Yo, you guys are good workers. See ya. <laughs> I'll go there in two minutes. I gotta go to the toilet. Okay. They were taking me back to the lobby, in the reception. <laughs> That's not where I need to go. <laughs> Those kids are probably gonna stitch up. We need to go to the restrooms now. Mm -hmm. This is the one. It's not a PZ video if we don't return back here. Someone just tried to open the door. I'm oh, dropped. I feel like they're looking for me now. This is it. Yeah, I'm, I'm here with my um, uncle Dingus. Is that the like on level 25? I think like these elevators don't go to 20, 25. Oh really? Which ones go to 25? Yeah, that's what he said. They're in the wrong building. You will not gain access to level 25. All right. Here. Hey man, thank you. Do you know where level 25 would be? Like in which building? You see why she's just walked up? Oh yeah, yeah. Oh no. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Hey, Uncle Dingus, what's up? Oh wait. No, I'm sorry. How are you? <laughs> that was good pretend. <laughs> I'm gonna follow these guys up the elevator. Is your scanner scan any of them, or does it only go That's your good. level? Not yet, but I think you need to scan outside the door. You came with us? Yeah, the oh, no. Nah, I came in with Joe Biden. Mm -hmm. no, no, no. We're on their level. Those guys were questioning me. I'm just glad it wasn't security, because then the challenge was done. There were no rooms open that I could get into to sleep, so I need to get back to the other hotel and get into those exclusive elevators, which has the penthouse suites, the restaurant, and the luxurious pool. But the only way up is by using a guest key tag. Shit. The work was giving me the evil look at the side, eh? We're just gonna act normal. There's five cameras above me right now. It felt like my dream of getting up there was never going to happen. Until this lady came with the blessing. Yeah, is this going to the restaurant? Thank you. Came to Atria. Yeah. Oh, this beautiful restaurant. You're doing very, very good things. Alright, that's good. Yeah. Yep, okay. Yeah. Thank you so much for that. Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? Um, no, I was just by myself, yeah. <laughs> now this is extremely high risk, but I'm gonna pretend I'm a hotel guest so I can receive free food and drinks at this restaurant. Thank you. Free Andrew Tate sparkling water. Thank you. Free nuts, sir. Mm. Ah. So an iced caramel latte, please. Thank you. <laughs> That's good. 
No, I give this a 10. And if you think that's crazy, just wait until you see what's coming for level two and three. There's three workers been looking at me. I'm gonna finish my coffee fast and go to the guest only hotel elevators and try and get to the pool area or just find a place to stay, something. Now we're done. Let's go. <laughs> So the guest elevators when we're going in. The workers are currently distracted. Hurry up before we get caught. <laughs> Scam me to 64 because my uncle's currently at that level, so sure. Oh, thanks, man. <laughs> level 69. Thank you. Nice. I'm about to get a foreigner right now. <laughs> Yahoo! This is amazing! I'm just gonna experience this for a bit, have fun. This is working me up. Currently seven hours. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Look like that shadow behind the door. I thought that was a guy. Oh my god, that was a heart dropping moment. That made me realize we're still at a high risk and could fail the challenge. So I need to stick to the task and find somewhere to sleep whilst experiencing the luxury of this hotel. Oh my goodness. It's free water. Mm. Oh, I was so dehydrated. Yes, that's what I need. <laughs> Bonjour, my friends. <laughs> Unfortunately, I've got the energy of an egg right now. I need to actually try and find a place to sleep. This could be an option right there. Then I realized I have the perfect That's spot. That's not gonna happen. <sighs> Which means level one, we succeeded. But now for level two, it's about to get exponentially crazy. We're about to travel across the world to the United States of America. For level two, I'm at the Beverly Hills Hotel where the rooms go for $7,000 per night. The Beverly Hills Hotel has been the hangout for the most glamorous stars in the world. <laughs> Hello, is there a, a toilet around here? Go to the, the lobby, all right, thank you. Hi, do you guys have a toilet that I could use? Of right here? course. Thank you. Go straight into the back. Wait, was it? <laughs> Excuse me, where's the restaurant area? Oh, right. Sticky, where is it? <laughs> Alright, thanks. <laughs> Now, as you can tell, the Beverly Hills Hotel is one of the most highly secure hotels in the world. And if I get caught and trespassed, I can get deported and banned from the US. The security guy was looking at me. The one that let me in earlier was looking at me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Crap. We're cornered. We have to go this way. Which is not good, because now I'm at a high risk of being spotted, so I need to find a discreet location to sleep. <laughs>
almost gave me a heart attack and sent me to hospital when they turned the light off. Someone that's poor, someone that has zero dollars to their name, experiencing this rich trillionaire lifestyle, it's actually crazy. Even I'm not even experiencing it. <laughs> we just gotta hope we don't get caught and keep moving. Yeah, I'm gonna go the opposite way to that. Definitely not that way. I'm not going that way. That's a private room. What in the world is this? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm back in the restroom. Look at this, everything is golden. What? So all we need to do is sleep here overnight and I'm gonna be sleeping in a, in a golden restroom. Bro, that's easy work. <laughs> My pillow consists of two toilet papers and a t-shirt. That's our pillow. Amazing. <laughs> but then as I was sleeping, I did not expect this to happen. My goodness. We did it. Oh, we did it. Thank you. Yeah. See ya. <laughs> Hotel Bel Air, level three, the make or break. We're gonna have to do our best job at convincing or bribing these people that Uncle Dingus set me up to this hotel. These walls are massive. The problem with this, it feels like a prison. It feels like you're gonna get locked in. The front entrance is over here. Look how many cars there are. We're about to get through. Let's attempt this. I'm going. Hey, I have a booking for a penthouse suite for tonight to meet Uncle Dingus. Do you know where that is? Yeah, up the steps, past the archway, towards your right. All right, thank you. Oh my goodness, I don't even know how I just did that. I know for a fact I won't survive here, so I want to accomplish three tasks before I get kicked out. Number one is to find the exclusive pool and jump in it. Oh, hello. <laughs> Enough jokes, let's go. Number four. I want to get through these missions one at a time. Oh, look at these fish. <laughs> Just eat it, imagine. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Where could the pool be? Level one is the hotel. <laughs> it's definitely down that way. What even is this? It's like an auction or something. I'm gonna go through the lobby entrance and then try and find the pool there. I think it might be on this side. No one questioned us. We go, see the pool. It's shut. I'm going in. I came here with a mission. If it means I get caught, I get caught. Oh, there's someone coming. Someone coming. Oh. oh, this is nice and warm. Oh, someone's coming. I'm done. Suits. I tried docking, but my head just floated back up. I'm getting out now. She's probably already sent security to come my way. All right, let's put the clothes on fire. So Jimmy, I'm coming for you at 100,000 subscribers. I'm sneaking into Mr. Beast headquarters. We're gonna do this together. No one's doing it like me. Task number two is to get free food and drinks at the exclusive five-star restaurant. But what I'm about to do is insanely risky. I use room 375 so they get free food at the restaurant. That's according to the Bel Air Hotel. So we'll see. The restaurant's right in front here. There we go. Hello, how are you? How are you? Good, how are you? Should I get a table for one, please? Yeah, I'm in room 375. Thank you. Since you're here, I'm going to set up the table for you. Thank you. I feel like they're really gonna bless you with just anything here. <laughs> this is crazy already. Delicious free water. I don't even know if water's free anyway. <laughs> Thank you so much. The caramel latte. 
It's like a five. <laughs> it's just a bunch of workers just walking around roaming. No one's looking suspicious so far. Who knows what's gonna happen as it keeps going on and on. Thank you. I was not expecting this so quick. This is insane. What? Way bigger than my pipsqueak of a head. Oh, that is insane. That is good. Like sooner or later, they're gonna know. I didn't book any hotel, nothing. I wiped that like a vacuum. Where's the restroom? Around this area. Thank you. I'm going. Thank you. Where is it? I'm just pretending that <laughs> that I didn't know where it was. Even though. We've done a full circle, we're back. I'm literally sitting in here, I'm not leaving until one hour. This is it. Here we go. Just gonna keep on moving. Thank you, man. Thank you. It's a gym. Gonna have a water. It's definitely real. <laughs> and it's fresh. Tastes good. Oh. How are we experiencing this right now? Together. I'm just grateful. Just experiencing everything I have in this seven hours that I've been here so far. I could have never afforded that. My YouTube check is virtually nothing every single month. So I'm glad that us dinguses, me and you, could achieve this goal together. To survive here for 12 hours and come out with a success. Yeah, I'm <laughs> come on, man. Oh. We succeeded. And now I gotta find my way home.